Part of the putting the remembrance comes in various forms. It comes through the preaching of the word. Um, it comes through uh, our daily conversations. I mean, uh, my wife is constantly reminding me of things that I know and I need to rehear. One time, I, on the, my father's one of the best men I know, one of the best preachers that I know, uh, godly man. And one time, he was going through a period of, of, of difficulty. And I was trying to encourage him. I said, Dad, how can I encourage you when you know the whole Bible backwards and forwards? You know way more than, than I could ever tell you. And he goes, I just need to rehear it, son. I need to rehear it. And we need to rehear what we know because sometimes we don't feel what we know to be true. We don't experience it. We kind of lose sight of it. And so in our conversations, we need to remind each other of the basic truths of scriptures, of the sovereignty of God, of the beauty of Christ, the humility of Christ, the kindness of Christ, and especially the day we live in. I think we get, we're getting more and more discouraged with our culture, with our society, and we need to hear the message that God is in control and that we're going to be victorious in the end, that we do not lose this battle. And, and that is a word that I need to hear today. But because I'm going to see evil tomorrow, I need to rehear that again tomorrow. And so the disciples of Christ have to disciple one another in the very things that they've already learned over the, over the years, over, even over the decades.